guys, welcome to Blossoming Wellness. Today I'm going to share with you my crystal collection. These crystals are very special to me. I've been collecting them over the years. I also have quite a few crystals from my personal collection listed in my Etsy store below. So make sure to check out that link and see if you want to pick up any crystals. And without further ado, let's jump into my collection. This Inclusion Quartz is my all-time favorite crystal. I'm just so in love with that rainbow. I also love this smoky quartz sphere. It is absolutely stunning. A similar crystal is this gorgeous rainbow calcite. You can get lost in this one. There are so many cool layers and rainbows to it. This citrine was purchased at the Tucson Gem Fair. I wanted to get a big tower when I went there and this one was just the one. It spoke to me, it's so beautiful. I think it's the most princess looking crystal in my collection. This smoky quartz flame is absolutely gorgeous. I have been so into flames recently and this one was a really beautiful purchase. This one is a newer purchase. It's a little mini one with an aura sheen, which I absolutely love. This smoky quartz reminds me of the Philosopher's Stone from Harry Potter. I think it's such a unique shape and I love the clarity of the crystal with the little rainbow striations. This smoky quartz was a Valentine's Day gift from my boyfriend. I absolutely love smoky quartz. It's just one of the crystals that I'm the most drawn to, and this one has such a deep, heavy energy. I love it. This is kind of its little mini version. You'll see I have a lot of big ones with little mini ones. Speaking of this stunning clear quartz I got when I started working my first job, it was a more substantial purchase, but then I have this little mini crackle quartz that resembles it quite a bit. This crackle quartz is one of the first crystals I bought when I started collecting. I'm so in love with this rose quartz flame. It has some rainbows and I just love it. I don't know why, I'm just completely obsessed with it. I got it a couple months ago and I keep it next to my bed because it's my little fave. This smoky quartz dodecahedron was a birthday gift from my boyfriend, and it is so cool, so unique. This amethyst was one of the very first crystals I purchased back in 2017. This amethyst resembles a cathedral. I love this amethyst for the rainbow flash in the front. It's so pretty and mystical. This is an inclusion quartz. Not only does it have really cool inclusions, but it has some little rainbow flashes and it's a substantial size, and here's its little mini. I actually gave this to my boyfriend, but I took it back because I just think it's so unique and I really wanted it in my collection. This citrine is stunning. I've had so many little citrine towers throughout the years, but this one is definitely my favorite. It just has so much going on within it, and it is gorgeous. I love this one too for its honey color, and it has a beautiful rainbow flash right in the front. This star rose quartz has an asterism, which is that little star-shaped line. I absolutely love this rose quartz for the deep pink color that it has. I've only recently gotten into rose quartz. It's one of the newer ones that I've been drawn to, so I've picked up quite a few of these aura rose quartz in the past couple months. I love keeping them by my bathtub and making it like a little self-love vibe there. This is a stunning amethyst. I keep a lot of my bigger amethysts throughout my home as decor. And this one I keep in my bedroom as well as this one. My mom actually found these for me, so I was really grateful that she got those. She also got me that one for graduation. And then I have my amethyst cathedrals, which are such a beloved part of my collection. This one is actually 65 pounds, so it's quite difficult putting it out here for this collection video. This was the first cathedral I got when I moved into my first apartment. I was so excited to get it. And this larger one is five feet tall, and I got it with my first paycheck from my first job. This smoky amethyst is a newer piece. I was really drawn to her for her little rainbow flash, of course. And I have some beautiful aura crackle quartz here, as well as another little aura quartz that I got in Santa Barbara. This was from the most beautiful crystal store in Santa Barbara, and if I can remember the name, I'll link it below. I got this amethyst out actually last week when I was out at a bar. They had a little crystal stand outside in Ocean Beach, San Diego, and I just had to pick it up, and I'm so happy I did. I love this labradorite. This is the only piece of labradorite in my collection. I'd love to get a bigger piece soon. 
This gorgeous inclusion quartz and this little baby moss agate are from Portland, and I think they're just imbued with forest vibes, which I absolutely love. I'm a huge fan of aura crystals, as you'll see. I know some people don't like them, but I just think they look so magical, and I love rainbows no matter how you get them, so I'm a huge aura fan. This is a little flower agate. I feel like flower agate has been so popular recently. I hadn't even heard of it until like a couple weeks ago. I might be listing this Aura Spirit Quartz in my Etsy, so make sure to check it out. It is a beautiful kind of gray color and it's a pretty big size. It has lots of different points. This is from the Tucson Jump Fair. My mom got me this quartz geode. I keep it in my bathroom and I keep that little aura crystal inside. I love this clear quartz for all of the crackles and striations and layers. It's so beautiful. I've had this clear quartz since I was a little girl. It's actually one of the pieces that I've had since before I started collecting and it is gorgeous. Some more amethyst. You can't have too much amethyst in your collection. Now I'm moving on to my tiny tumbles. So this smoky quartz has so many rainbows. I recently got this citrine in San Francisco. It's really beautiful. I love these clear quartz crystal balls. They are so magical and my beautiful moonstone. I'd love to get a big moonstone soon. Then I have some pretty rose quartz and some Megano calcite. These beautiful amethyst tumbles. This one's especially beautiful. This rose quartz has so many rainbows inside. These amethysts are from Idaho. Sometimes I like to pick up tiny tumbles on vacation because it's easier to travel with. This spirit quartz looks like a little teddy bear to me and it was one of the first crystals I purchased as well. And this amethyst I keep in my shower, which is why it has some calcifications on it, but it's really beautiful. And I love Himalayan salt lamps to set the vibe. So here's my full collection. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye.